Hi guys, we're going to talk about Vasily Kandinsky. He is a Russian Impressionist artist. He was alive from 1866 to 1944. So I'm just going to go ahead and present my screen and we're going to take you through these slides so that you can learn a little bit more about this artist and be able to answer the questions on the Google form that follow. Okay, so uh, the picture is called Color Study Squares with Concentric Circles painted in 1913 using watercolor, gouache, and crayon on paper. Um, at the age of 30, he left his law school to attend art school in Munich, Germany. And at this time, French Impressionist artists heavily influenced his art. The Impressionists used color and light to show their subjects rather than painting in fine detail. So a lot of color was used. So that's why you can see this painting uh, on the left, where Kandinsky was trying to experiment using more colors to portray the lights and shadows in artwork. So subject matter took a backseat to the role color played in his painting, and his use of color began to express an emotional experience rather than reflect life. At an early age, Kandinsky exhibited a gift called synesthesia cognate, and this gave him the ability to hear colors and see sounds. That's right, hear colors and see sounds. And this painting on this page is called Composition 8, done in 1923, um, and it is oil paint on canvas. His art became influenced by pieces of music, such as Composition 7, which is the artwork you see on this side. Due to his ability to hear color and see sounds, he often listened to music while he painted, and that's going to be very important. He is recognized today as the pioneer of abstract art. His non-representational painting paved the way for the abstract expressionist movement that dominated American painting after World War II. And the painting on this page is Delicate Tension number 85, done in 1923 and is watercolor and ink on paper. Now, this painting called Intersecting Lines, done uh, painted in 1923, oil on canvas, uh, try, I want you to try to hear this painting. What does it sound like? So just look at it and, and try to imagine that it's making music. Okay, and then next, I want you to close your eyes and listen to the song below and try to see it. What does it look like in your mind? So then you will click on this link here and it will take you to a video um, a music, there's no video, but it'll take you to YouTube where it plays just the music and you will listen to this song called Dream Chasers. And I want you to try to see what it would look like if it was making art right in front of your eyes. Okay, and that ends this slideshow and then you will go into more videos on um, how to complete the assignment.